Good morning. I'm Zach Walker. This is X Variety Show. Happy Monday. It's Monday. We are wearing our Extra Life shirt today. We are also running our Extra Life banner. Remember, we are 60% of the way to doing a 12-hour stream for Extra Life. So um, thank you so much. All right. I'm not going to play Minecraft or Rocket League today, buddy. I'm going to play Tarkov. That's right. Yes. What are you going to do? Okay, thank you. Um, you should play on mommy's computer for a bit. Okay, so we're going to uh, jump on over to the game board and we'll just get started talking about it. Um, Tarkov is a very in-depth game, so we'll just roll in. Mm -hmm. All right, so we are so close to being able to do flea market and auctions. Um, let's look at our dealers for a minute. Um, we are level 15 for the next level of Jaeger. Uh, we're doing okay on getting his money up there. Let's just make sure we have all the tasks we can from him. Okay. Um, we need food anyway. And let's um, check power We've got uh, plenty of money spent with him. Which means when we get to level 15, we'll be able to go up to tier 2. Uh, therapist is the same way. We spent plenty of money with the therapist, which means as soon as we get to that level, we'll be able to go straight on up. Um, what is this? A cricket? We have a cricket. And matches. We have the wrong kind of matches, but that's okay. We're working on it. Uh, lunch boxes. We need syringes, but we're not going to worry about that either. So we've got all this um, stuff. We've kind of set up a pretty good starter loot um, set up for ourselves. As you can see, I'm starting to um, consolidate down a little bit. Got things rolling. I got the mechanism backpack. That uh, gives me more space than what it takes up. Two, three, four, five by one, two, three, four, five, which is... 25, and then if you do this, 4, 8, 12, 16, 24, we've got a lot more. So we're good. And then actually, I'm going to take this backpack and sort it. There we go. Um, okay, so we've got ourselves set up the way we want to. We've got plenty of rigs for our game. We don't have a lot of body armor, but that's just uh, the way the everything crumbles. We've got plenty of meds um, stored up. Got a little bit of food. Let's see, why don't we look at what green tea does. It's um, 15 hydration. Why don't we take some crackers and tea with us in our next raid that we go in. And then um, I think we're good there. Got a little good body armor, a little good compact. Not too bad. We haven't picked a weapon for the next raid that will run. I'm thinking we're going to go go in kind of quiet. So maybe we'll take a sighted AK. And a little bit of um, bullets. That should be good there. We've got one of each kind of grenade ready to go. We've got our healings, our heals ready to go. We've got our pouch set up, ready to roll. So I think we're good there. I feel like uh, I'm just waking up. So um, it might benefit us for me to go ahead and go in and do a scav run real quick. So let's just go ahead and um, jump on in. I want to get my map up. Um, while we're waiting, uh, over the weekend, we had some of our um, friends from Tarkov follow us. 
I want to thank Army for following, and thank you Bloodshed for following. It was kind of fun uh, playing with you guys, so thanks for coming in and becoming Leafwalkers. Alright, so we are going to open up our map. And the thing with our map, Twitter, alright, I... I'm going to double check that everything's working here. We're going to make sure that our bot is working. We're going to pop ourselves off. Um, hello there. Just to make sure that we are... Um, custom chat command 10,000. Dance off 3,000. Temporary voice acting 1,000. 1,000 special rules for a round. Modify single emote. Hello there. Okay. We're going to do hello there. Hello there. Okay, so that's working. Um, our walker bot should be working. Zach is probably too old for Instagram, but you, Can you, go on you are not? Will yes, again. come join us on Instagram, LeafWalker. I can turn on your little walker cam. Do you... Oh, you want to play Rocket League while I'm doing this? Okay. okay. Let's work on that. Where is it? Ah, oh, Lil Walker Cam transparent. Lil Walker Cam. There we go. All right. Um, let's do a filter. We'll make it a little transparent. There we go. Got a little walker cam rolling. Okay. All right, so we're good there. A little walker cam transparency up and running. Okay. So let's double check where we're going to go here. We've got customs. Uh, we're gonna, uh, it's like 7 a.m. That's not bad. We're going to make sure we're a scav, which we are. So I think we're ready to run this run. <laughs> okay. So we have got our run running around. Um, we're searching for a server. Sounds like we've got sound for a server now. So that's pretty good. Um, let's go ahead and dump our map up on the top screen. I forgot about that for a second. So games, Tarkov, maps, all maps. And then... We can close woods because I still haven't fixed that. And then we're not going to do that yet. So we're going to go ahead and hide all. We're going to add caches back in. All right. So we're going to move this up here. Yeah, I'm not. 
All right, here we go. Oh, good, 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 good. This is right. Okay, so we're gonna open this up. Check it out. What we got? We got a bandage. We're gonna move that up here. Put it down here. Put those marks up there. Put the AI two there, and then we're going to. There's no loot there. Perfect. We're gonna roll out of here. See what's in this chest. Got some BP. That's interesting. Um, a fuse. That's not bad. That's good for grenades. Nothing in there. All right. So let's see. Okay. So we scaved in at 31 minutes. Uh, scav checkpoint. Yikes. Road to military base. Okay. So. If we want to get out, we're going to have to go past dorms anyway. So why don't we relax and do some soft looting in here. We're not in a hurry. And essentially anybody who spawned in here is already going to have been here. So we're just coming through and we're going to try and wipe up after some gunfights, I think. This metal. Alright. Uh, let's see what we got with our gun. We got a single fire gun. Check our mag. Get used to that. You know, oh, we don't get compass as a scow. Yike. Get used to checking my corners a little. I know there's really not much in here, um, loot-wise, but I'm just gonna check anyway, because... Mm. I'm just gonna be as careful as possible. All right. Come on. You're inside shipping container. I know you're in the shipping container. I can't just screw around with that. Come on, dude. You know you're dead. Gosh, this is full. Okay, so we're gonna put everything in the Triton.
Alright, so. What key did we just get? I don't even know what it is. It's, uh... Portable cabin key of customs factory zone. That was a lot of noise. We made a lot of noise. Other people made a lot of noise. I don't know how much noise... ...that was actually... ...made. But someone's, like, right here. Put that armor on. Take his AK. Take his rigs. The armor 23 of 40. We'll put that in here. Got an MRE. That's nice. Check this rig. Nice. Okay. Chances of us getting out now are close to zero, I'd say. This is so much stuff. Uh, I'm going to come in here and repack a mag or two. Because I'm... I've never actually done this. Alright, so... Watching the stream and have hey, leaves, thanks. you can use them in the Bot chat box Overlord. to get perks, like making Zach dance badly. Okay, so now we've got our full stuff. Did we take any damage from that fight? Not really, no. Alright, so what we want to do, we want to get to railroad to military, but we got to get out of here. I think we have enough loot. We don't really want to risk playing the game much longer here. So if we can just get out of here. That'd be nice. So we're just going to softly work our way out this way. So much junk. Um, I mean, I guess I don't really want to make it too easy for him, but it doesn't really matter because I'm going to get killed anyway. Uh, <laughs> like, if you think about it, I'm most definitely going to get fragged at some point with this much loot on me. Um, yep. There's very little chance. I make it out of here alive. 
but we are going to try. We've only bumped into scabs. Essentially, if we meet a PMC, we're done. Like, that's just the reality of it. I'm not good enough to take out PMCs yet. I've only taken out a couple PMCs. And, um, a lot of those were super lucky and I had to drop on them like crazy. Crazy drops on people. So... We just want a nice sneaky sneak out of here. But my, um, my success level currently for sneaking out of this area is fairly low. I mean, the only thing I got going for me is it's pretty late in the raid, and oh. And because it's pretty late in the raid, um, and because it's fairly late in the raid right now, we've, um, why would I do that? Okay. Um, a lot of people are already kind of, um, dying slash dead, so. I'm just going to take as much stuff as I can, mostly because free loot's free loot. But, um, if I make it, I make it. That'd be amazing. Um, as you saw, even with the scabs, I have a hard time getting a headshot right now uh, without a uh, red dot or anything on this weapon. So, if I run into a PMC and they have any decent armor at all, I'm in a little bit of trouble. But there's no point running. There's no point getting all crazy. We've got plenty of time to get out of Tarkov. I just want to make sure we don't run into anybody else trying to get out of Tarkov. Um, this defies logic, just um, going so slow through here normally run across here and minimize my time, but I'm trying to make the least amount of noise possible. Remember, there's almost no risk in this. This is all free. From this point on, nothing I'm doing, I'm not risking any of my own um, gear on this run, because it's a full-on scav run, so I can be a bit more gutsy but there's a difference, like the boat's up. I have to be careful, people will be coming for it. Um, there's a difference between being gutsy and just being dead. This is another danger spot. Yeah. There's someone like right here. I 
heard that pop. I could have come from anywhere. But we're going to be super careful as we come up to this corner and check it. This is a very dangerous transfer spot for me. I don't have a lot of cover when I take the transfer. bad transfer. I think we did okay. We're still kind of out in the open. But I think we're going to have to deal with that as we come along to it. This is another really dangerous transfer to get past dorms. Um, Railroad to Tarkov is easy to get out of. so rare that you have such a good scav run that you're actually skilling up your scav skills as you go. Um, Alright, so here's a problem I'm going to have, and it's a very big problem. There's definitely people in dorms. Um, no contest people in dorms. And the question is just how focused are they on the externals? Hopefully they already know that the shit. I'm just gonna run it. Um, hopefully they already know that the car is gone. I took a little damage. We're just gonna press six while we walk. Hmm, <laughs> nothing too, too terrible. I'd rather be full health if we engage a PMC. Like it or not, this is where we are, so we're running it. We're just going to run as far as we can, as fast as we can. If we can get around the wall alive, holy shit, there's a dead guy there. I'm not even going to look at him. Alright, we're right at our exit point. Railroad to military base. We can get there. We just need to not die on the extract. So why don't we just go for it? Because we're low on time. And other people are going to be running for their extract soon. We're just going to use our guts. No guts, no glory on this one. Could be somebody checking that stash, but I don't have time. I don't really want to get stuck in a bad transfer situation here. We're just going for it hard. Come on, tell me I can hit it on this side. I can. We're just going to sit here and pray nobody sees us. Three, two, one, we're out. Nice. Scavron just made some money. Okay, we took killed two scavs, headshot and killed. Alright, so we've got 
stuff to handle. Okay, so boom, boom, boom. Okay, food, water. I'm gonna move some water out of here. We're gonna take an MRE and put it in as food. We're gonna move some food in, I think. Put that bandage up. Wasn't too bad. Okay, so we've got stuff to sell. I'm gonna put that right here. And then um, we've got AK and an AK mag. So that is a another raid gun we've got. So why don't we throw that in here? AK with AK mags. Looks like these are the exact same things. So maybe we'll um, move it up a little. Move this shotgun up a little bit there. Okay, so then we've got this gun, the ADR, which uh, I did okay with, but nothing to write home about. Put those mags there. We've got, um, double check, come on up here. We're gonna put this in. There. Put our parts container. We're gonna put our masks with our other masks. Uh, we're gonna take these sunglasses. Those are definitely sellable. We've got some armor. Hey, armor. We're gonna put armor there. Sell our. Event. We got a new helmet. Pretty happy about that, and some credit contacts. So, um, we've got everything off of our, we want to put the BP in our ammo case, our new pizza in our pizza case, our cheese, our new cheese, our cheese case. Um, we'll take this and put it right here. Put the water to the right, and then we put the extra meds there. Then we've got more, that's just usable cheese, bandage, put the bandage there, and then another at. Okay, so we've got that out of there. Then we're going to put this mask with the other masks. Watching the stream and have leaves? This is You can sellable. use them in the chat box to get perks, like making Zack dance badly. Okay, thank you, bot overlord. Um, all right, so let's go ahead and jump back up here. We'll throw our ammo in the ammo case. What is this? This is slugs. We'll put those in the ammo case. And then we've got our... One of these tritons is our... This is clips. Clips as well. Um, ADRs. Cheese. So one of these is our... Um, Hold on, one of these, not this one, not this one. Is this commando here? No, that commando's cheese, so this commando should be our parts. There we go. We'll put this in here. There's our parts. This is also a part. Then we have a scab vest, which we can either sell or turn into fabric. And we got an LKF, another but a body armor, I believe. This is the M3 body armor we needed found in raid. All uh, right, and then we've got keys to go in our docks case for now, and then a fuse which goes down here. Crafting materials. Then we have a nice little um, L3. Uh, a blue shoot me backpack, so we call it. We'll put it in our blue shoot me backpack containers. Okay, so we'll put it in our blue shoot me backpack, and then we have a pilgrim. How much? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, seven, and five. How much does a pilgrim take up? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so this is a pack to be used. 
um, on a big raid. So we'll put that down here. That's a huge pack. We'll put that on our... Um, we're going to use this pack in the raid that we use this gun in, essentially. So we'll put the gun in there. Um, cool. So these are our sellables. Our immediate sellables. Uh, we got another Triton. Which is the same as a Commando. Which means we don't need it, so that is a usable rig for a raid now. Because we've got plenty of space. So let's go ahead and take this Triton and make it a usable rig for raid. Then that means we have got everything out of our scav run. We did some little bit of looting. Did a little bit of combat. Had a good accuracy. Not too bad, and that's good for me. So, not bad. Pretty good raid. Um, let's go ahead and um, I gotta open up a internet screen. We'll open up the stream. Thank you. It's muted. Thank you for being muted, stream. Stream, please. And then we'll open up our mod view of the stream. Perfect mundo. Nice. Okay. So we did a pretty good run there. Nothing too crazy, nothing too fancy. It was just a nice little run, and we're going to jump up here and look at our captions. Nice. Our captions are doing pretty good. Captions are doing pretty good. Yeah, that's not too bad. Um, Blah. And then I think we're just waiting to come out of the raid, to be fair. It's a good thing we've got little walkers stuff going. Oh, we've got predictions, huh? We're gonna start this. Start a prediction. Let's uh do this again. Named prediction will Zach. Survive this raid. Will Zach survive this raid? Outcome, yes, no. Submission period will do, um, make it a five minute vote that should do just about right will zek survive this raid yes no this is a very easy vote uh to make are you done little walker okay little walker looks like little walker's done so we're going to turn off Lil Walker Cam. Okay, so we made it back. All right, not bad. Got some decent armor for our raids coming up. Got a few helmets. Got some ears. Not the greatest of helmets, but other than nothing. Uh, let's move this up here. 
There, we got that there. We've got our guns all set up. Uh, let's find out what kind of ammo is in this for a second. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Oh, I went into my inventory somewhere. Ah, there it is. Okay, so the ammo that was in this is uh, five five six. Five five six forty five. Um, okay. M eight five six A one. So let's check it out. Five five six forty five. It's not there. It's not there. Not there. Okay, so this is not the same stuff, but I think this might be my only 55645. Five, so let me buy some. We'll buy 21. No, I think that's a 30 clip, so why don't we buy 60? Right, so we'll buy 60 of it, and um, we're going to reload this, and then our 60 will come in, and we'll fill it, top it off, and we'll um, fill this one up there, and then the rest of this will go in our ammo case. Okay, so we've got an extra spot here. This is where most of our stuff's going to land, and I'm liking that. Why don't we... Actually, put it between the docks case and the ammo case, like right there. Um, oh, actually, that would make it easier to see, so we'll just leave it right there. Then, um, so we're all set here. Got this reloaded. We're ready. I think we might actually be ready to roll after we sell off this uh, stuff to Jaeger to bring up our money quoting with him. That's not too bad. We're going to get that. Pretty good. And then let's see the ragman, maybe. Too bad there. And then I'm guessing skier for the big fluffy Sherpa hat. No. Okay. Rapper? No. I mean, surely it's not the nurse. We're not even going to check. We'll check mechanic. No. Alright, let's just go right through them all so we know that they don't do it. Not Jaeger. Not Ragman. Not the mechanic. Not the peacekeeper. Not the skier. Not proper. Therapist? Of course not. So we're going to have to sell it to the fence. I didn't want to sell it to the fence, but that was our choice. Mm. Speaking of the fence, we should check him out real quick. Um, boo, 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 IFAC. Has a little bit of resource. It's not bad for an IFAC, but we'll be all right. There we go. That's what we're looking for. Looking for things we haven't seen before. Get some experience. Is that a white armband? Yikes. All right. I won't just double check anything here. There's really nothing that we need to buy straight up, as far as I know. 
Because most things need to be found in the raid, or they're ridiculously expensive. So we're not going to really... I mean, look at all this stuff, but that rig's ridiculously expensive, $89,000. But how many spaces does it have? Two, four, eight, twelve, sixteen, eighteen. It's only got two extra spaces. It's not even not even worth it as a space saving rig. Okay, so how much time do we have left on the dealers? We've got six minutes on mechanic. Nothing really important. So we're in a good spot to go ahead and start our next run. Let's go ahead and escape from Tarkov. We're going to go PMC. Oh, we've only got three minutes for the scav right now. Hmm. I think we're going to go PMC. We've got things to do. Let's look at our tasks. Um, so we've got to neutralize scavs in woods, which we're not going to do right away. Uh, eliminate scavs on customs. That's something we do need to do. I think we'll just go ahead and go for that. Um, what else do we have on customs? Nothing really. We have um, body armor that we're going to find in factory when we start really running it. Gunsmithing, we really need to be level two. Uh, and then this can be found anywhere. But we find food, so... Probably more likely to find it in the woods, but we're going to go customs to get our 15 scav kills, I think. And we did pretty good surviving customs this last time. So um, here we go. We're going to escape from Tarkov, PMC, next. And the answer is customs, and we're going to go at 11, and we're just going to come in and ensure everything. Takes that's expensive. And then next, and... Ready to escape from Tarkov. All right, so there we go. Um, we're rolling. We've got a very good idea of where things are in customs, so that does help us out quite a bit. Zach is probably too old for Instagram, but you, you are not? Yes, come join us on Instagram, Leafwalker. <laughs> yes, come join us on Instagram, Leafwalker. All right. We're going to start our prediction. We're starting our prediction of whether Zach will survive... This raid, it is a five-minute prediction. Um, yeah, lots of fun. We're gonna keep on rolling here. Not doing too bad. If we get some good kills, we might actually clip them, but I don't think that's going to happen. We could, uh, I think maybe we could do some slither while we wait, but it's always a little dangerous to do that. Because, um... If we're rolling slither when um why never actually there we go if we're rolling slither when it comes up then we get a little um freaked out at the beginning and it gets a little crazy let's see five minutes looks like it might be short Maybe I'll make it more like a 10 minute and pop it when we start. Looks like we're going to be in real quick here, though, so that'll be nice. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and do this. We're doing good. 
<clears throat> Alright, where are we? Ooh, that's an interesting start. This is essentially the same start we had with, as the scab just a minute ago. Check our extracts. Our extraction points are dorms, ZB11, ZB12, ZB13, old gas. Okay, so we need to go south anyway in our up our AU with roadblock if we want to survive this. So why don't we PMC. There's no point in whispering. going to be looting. He's got to be looting that kill. I can't hear him anywhere, though. Okay, so we killed that scab.
that galaxy guy? So the answer is no for the prediction. We'll choose, choose the prediction outcome. The answer was no. Congratulations, everybody who voted no. Kill the scav. Shouldn't have killed the scav. I should have let the other guy kill the scav. All right. We did get some experience out of that, though. Okay. So we're now we're in the next bug. So while we're waiting for the next bug, let's go ahead and slither IO. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and go ahead and do what we need match analysis. No, we don't want match analysis, we want This one. Boys and girls, hurry and pull up your get your tickets here. Your last chance to see the Titanic. All right. <laughs> so we're going to remove this overlay. You're off. Man, pay attention because the rest of the most majestic ship won't be around. All right. So we got, um, Next, we'll apply. Oh no, we'll go next. And then let's go ahead and hide the Slither IO overlay for a second. Um, while we wait for ourselves to come out of the raid, I guess we're still waiting for ourselves to come out of the raid so we can play Slither. All right, here we go. Slither while we wait to come out of our raid. Ah, he ate me. We'll play again. Buddy, that's loud. That's good, thank you. Okay, we're gonna play again. Still waiting for um, ourselves to get out of this raid. There we go, now we're out of the raid. Okay, let's go ahead and kill the Slither. And then let's go ahead and uh, check our messenger. Yes, I get it. Although that guy's probably gonna use my thing like crazy. Okay, so let's go ahead and set ourselves up for our next raid in. We're going to go with a cheesy press thing. We're going to use a cheesy green helmet. We're going to use some ghost. We're going to use a, probably just a bank robber rig. And then we're going to go with the... Um, We'll use that ADR that we had that last match. Oh, we got a scab kill. So we're working our way forward, even if even though that was a terrible short round, we still got our scav kill, so that worked out really well for us. Alright. We're not really gonna run water or anything. I don't think we'll have a problem. Um, we're good there. I think this is just how we're going to run. We're going to run with... Um, since we're already running blue, why don't we run a... a shoot me pack pack. We'll look every... Oh, no, we shouldn't do that. Um, we should open... We'll run a shoot me backpack and that will um help us kind of just uh, limit our risk for this run let's go ahead and jump in 
So let's uh, we're gonna start the prediction actually. Zach survived this raid. All right, so we got five minutes for that. We're gonna jump into our rain. Character's heavily wounded. Oh, that's right, I did that on purpose. Um, and you should be like, why? Because I'm going to heal all and get a butt ton of experience for healing. <laughs> uh, now I'm gonna go into the game. Escape from Tarkov PMC. Next. Customs, 1300, and next, and ensure all, and ensure, and next, and ready to roll. Did you go and get a flosser? That's good. All right, well, while we're waiting, I'm going to grab a drink. Uh, check out that will. Like, boom! Hey, Oxcar, how's it going? Figured I was going to grab a drink real quick before my raid started up. How's your raids gone? Going all right? Still trapped inside? <laughs> Roger that. You don't really play EFT that much? That's cool. I mean... I don't really play it that much either, to be fair. I play a lot more Rocket League. Um, thus, I have a level 9. So, <laughs> uh, But I have um, been playing quite a bit at night on the weekends with uh, some of the streaming crew. So, mm -hmm. It very much stresses me out, too. Um, that's why I'm kind of glad I only stream two hours a day. Because, like, um, I can handle Rocket League stress for hours and hours and hours and hours and hours and hours. But, like, if I'm doing a shooter, that's a lot Watching of stress. Watching stream and have leaves? You can use them in the chat box to get perks. Like making Zach dance. Badly. This is true. Um, so, thank you, Bot Overlord. I, yeah, leaves. But, yeah, um, shooters stress me out quite a bit. But I'm getting to the point where, um... I have so much gear now that it's not quite so uh, stressful, right? Like, that was one of my better kits I just lost, but even though it's one of my better kits, I'm still like, eh, whatever. It's not my best kit, and I can say that. It was probably my best body armor, though. You've been on the Rocket League grind, too? What's your, what level are you on now? What's your um? Are you doing rank or are you just doing casual? Oh, that's fine. <laughs> casual is actually harder than rank sometimes. Um, my. My casual MMR is something like a thousand five hundred and some odd, or a thousand four hundred and some odd. So I'm actually playing worse people than I am in, or I'm actually playing better people in casual than I am in ranked, because I'm only a diamond in ranked. And I'm not even fully a diamond. I'm an, on the diamond plat line. It just depends on what I'm playing. Uh, you're C2, but you deranked a bunch because you barely played for the past two seasons. Oh, yeah, that's rough. And that doesn't help that now everything's kind of shifted with all the new free-to-play people. There's a lot more people in the game. So things are a little... Um, there's a lot of people who are finding it a lot harder to play right now. Uh, here we go. We're escaping Tarkov. Let's move the Slither I.O. off so we have our customs map. We've got our prediction up. We have 25 seconds left in the Will I Survive This Raid prediction. Where the heck am I? Oh, I'm actually in the factory. 
All right. Okay, this is a single fire weapon. Are there scabs in here? Don't see any scabs. Yeah, the rank reset was a little tough for me too, um, but actually it's not because I'm actually getting better because I was really bad before the rank reset, the last rank reset. Like, <laughs> so it's um. It didn't hurt me as much because I'm still finding my place in Rocket League. That was, uh, this is a really big building to not have any loot, right? It's gotta have something. Really? That's... Come on, I'll read that as soon as I understand what the heck I'm doing. Oh, uh, there we go. Alright, so let's, we'll start a search and, um... Okay, so, because when you were in C3, people were pretty awful. <laughs> that makes things cleaner for people who deserve to be there. Um... Yeah, see, the part I, um... Really? Are you serious? What is this? I'm just gonna hold this. Oh shit! He heard me. I'm so in trouble. He must definitely heard me. don't like this ox car. This guy sounds pretty heavy. I know. <laughs> he came rolling up on me when I was in here and I've got a single shot rifle. And he definitely has something with fully auto. <laughs> Wondering if I'm brave enough to, um... There we go. We're clearing up our... Clearing up our red dot a little. I'm so screwed. He knows I'm here. There's no way he's not going to go up these stairs. Need to move. But
He's going ape. That and my spatial memory failing me. So the question is, do I just sit here? I think I do. I think I just sit here, I'm sorry. <laughs> The man is stacked. <laughs> Absolutely no way he looks behind this container, though. Can't even see me from that door. This is like advanced cat and mouse at this point. <laughs> How many people are in this building? <laughs> I mean, I know that's outside, but yeah, that shooting's outside. I'm hoping he left, but I'm not willing to test it. He's still real close. All right, so I need to figure out where we are. Um, I think... This might be warehouse four. Am I next? I'm next to old gas. Oh, so it's that, um, it's the rectangle building, right? Or near. Yeah, I know I'm over there somewhere. I'm either in warehouse four or in the little rectangle building next to warehouse four, I think. I know I'm not inside the main area with Stronghold or construction. I'm in the factory area. Um, ZB-13. Where is ZB-13? That's over by RAUF Roadblock? No, that's in Stronghold. ZB-13 is Stronghold. It's the one in line with the customs door key. Right. Oh, yeah, yeah, I know what you're talking about. Um, okay. So I can plot a course. I don't really want to go into ZB. Oh, yeah, that's Warehouse 4. Yeah, exactly, Warehouse 4. So I'm in Warehouse 4. And I need to get to ZB13, which is in the bottom of Stronghold. I don't really want to go to Stronghold. Um, I guess I could work my way over to Crossroads and Trailer Park, but that's that's asking for it. Smuggler's Boat, I guess. Jeez. Uh, ZB13 needs power. Yeah, no, I'm not going to give it power. I don't. I don't know how to do that yet. I will worry about that when I. Um, all right, so I haven't heard anything for a while inside, so why don't we? Is 
see if we can find some bodies and from the carnage and uh, kind of uh, rat in on this guy's kills. What? That was super loud. Alright, so my boy rolled on through here. And then as soon as he came through here, there was... What the hell is going on here? Did you hear all that gunfire? Looks like my boy rolled on through here and didn't even loot. Look at that. What is that? That's a scope and a half. are so close. Power is at the far back of this building, by the way. Yeah, I'm just gonna roll. There's so much, so much activity here. Oh my god. I know we're kind of boring right now, but if I run into a PMC, I'm schmucked, so I'm being really careful. Got a couple sites already that we could use if we can get out. I've got money for dorms and smugglers, and then Crossroads is an easy escape, so I think that's what we're doing. Holy snikes. So much battle right outside. Is that like sniper scab out there? Is that what's going on? That's a factory door, right? I don't think I have that key. Is it open? Is it open? It's not open. So if we could get out... I don't trust myself to make the porta potty jump. Oh, shit. There's definitely someone shooting at me, right?
Вон оно пыль! Вот я. Did he fall down the hole? Вон он, блядь, вон он, ебашь его! Вон он! Вот он! Oh god, I forgot to reload. Just died to scabs. That's unfortunate. Yeah. <laughs> ah, that's okay. Wish I would have got a little more experience from it, but you know what? We'll get our experience in the healing. Not a big deal. It's... It's crazy, right? Like, if I spawned Trailer Park or Crossroads, that gun with that sight would have been awesome. But to spawn inside the close quarters with a single shot weapon, that's real rough. Real rough. But, you know, that's how it works, so. All right, we're, we're going to wait for our... Raid to clear. So we're waiting for our raid to clear. Uh, we're going to choose our prediction outcome. The answer was indeed no. It's a fairly easy outcome to have chosen. <laughs> All right. Not too bad. No, nobody thought this would happen. I agree. <laughs> nobody thought that would make it out either. All right, we're going to start a new prediction. We're going to start the prediction. Will Zek survive this raid? And we're going to make the, uh, make it a, we're going to make it a 10 minute prediction that starts as soon as I leave the last raid. So, will Zek survive this next raid? It's going to be a scab raid. We're going to run our scab since our scab is up again. Predict with channel points. Zero versus zero. Will Zek survive the raid? I hate the stock ADR. You can't take the iron sight off the barrel and the gun becomes unusable. That makes sense, I guess. Yeah, I was... You have confidence. <laughs> okay, well, we'll see. Um, Let's go ahead and uh, heal up. Look at all that experience. Yimes. Let's see. Let's look at our... Skills. A. Hey. Getting a lot of experience from healing up, though, at least. All right, so let's go ahead here. Overall. Main menu. Escape from Tarkov. Scab run with a little auto pistol, looks like. Yes, I know. That's... I was, uh, I need to get one of those for my tasks, but the problem, I've found plenty of gas analyzers. The problem isn't finding them. The problem is finding them and getting out alive. Um, do, do, do. All right, we're going to scab customs. 1600. We're ready. It's PP two hundred. Yeah, I like the I like the little SMG. It's just like and you're like, woohoo. <laughs> but uh oh my gosh.
All right, let's um jump into Let's do it. We've got the slither. We've got the IO. Who died? Yum. Ooh, that looks dangerous for us. Let's get away. We can do this. Okay, that guy's big. We'll yummy yummy that little yummy. That was fun. Then we'll run. Maybe we'll follow this trail here. This guy's trying to kill me. I'll eat his yumminess. That guy tried to kill me too. We'll eat his yumminess. Oh, and now we're out. Let's go ahead. Let's gav in. Let's move. Alright. I know where I am now. We go get the cash, right? We go full auto. We crouch in this bush. We check out our equipment. We get our cash under the pipe. Alright, so let's see. What we got, what we got, what we got, what we got. Gear. Cigarettes. Don't really care about those. Uh, bandage. We need that on one. We need this on two. We're going to hit our Vaseline right away because why the heck not? Mm, it'd be nice to get out with some Vaseline. I could actually use some in raids. Come down here. Sounds like a fight going on over there. All right, let's come down here. hit up pipes and see if we can't find anything in the cache on pipe 2. Is it this cache? Oh, it's, no, it's like here, right? Where is it? I don't know where the cache is at. I know it's here. Oh. There it is. jump back across the top here. We're actually going to search out this fight, I think. I need to get rid of my jitters. It's raining. He might not hear me as easily. Can't see. Thank you. Alright, we're going to come across. Oh, 
those shots are over there, I think. I'm gonna go into construction. There he is, there he is. Me and this guy. I can't tell what kind of scab that is. Oh no! Get a shoddy! Oh! <laughs> on that scab so hard and I still lost. Did I even hit him? I don't think I did. Oh, I did. Just not good enough. Mm -hmm. I just ran out of bullets, too. Apparently it was a really small clip. Yeah, I haven't figured out how to um, adjust for the range. I need a shooting range pretty bad because the problem I'm having with hip firing is normally I would assume it's going to be in the middle of my screen. That doesn't seem to be the case with Tarkov very much. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna have to practice it because it seems it's it's hard to just be like, I'm gonna do it and then Yeah. Oh, well, I don't know. <laughs> yeah. So it's just it's the gun is always yeah, it's not like the gun's less accurate because you're not aiming. It's just you have to know where it's gonna go. I get you. Hmm. Well, we have a half hour. We're going to run another PMC. <laughs> you believed in me. That was a player scab that killed me? I thought I couldn't tell. Nobody thought this would happen. <laughs> wow, uh, what is with the downheim? Right, but I couldn't tell that the guy who came around the corner was supposed to be a scab. Like, the one who shot the other scab. I'm still having a hard time differentiating between actual PMC skins and scab skins. I'm going to have to look it up and, like, really focus on it. Like, I saw... The only reason I knew the guy coming this way was a player in some way was because he was too, 
you know, direct, he turned, he shot the those cav. That's a bonus. <laughs> That's true. That makes sense. Oh boy, that was a little rough. I mean, there's times where my scabs look like me. Oh, like my PMC. Like, I guess that doesn't really look like a PMC, but. All right, so let's check it out. We're going to run our. Back to our Paca. I'm going to run a shoot me backpack. Oh, no, we'll run a duffel. And then. Yeah, if you have an armband on. That does make sense. Um, We'll put on the ma. And then why don't we go with the... Go with this AK. And then we'll run a bank robber because we're going solo. I'll take where'd that go? There. Yeah. Hey, Wolfie, how you doing? All right. So I'm not going to even bother running a grenade right now. I'm not running with people. Grenades are pretty precious for me still. I'm just going to run in. Ooh. Okay, there we go. Oh, yeah. I know the 3M armor is used for the quest, but it has to be... Um, I'm on that quest, but the problem is I bought this. I didn't, like, it wasn't found in raid. I can maybe, but it still has to be found in raid Um, for my task. It's this one. Oh, yeah, this. Was it found in Raid? It was. Oh, my gosh. Wait, 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 wait. Whose task was that? That's the, the skier. Okay. Whoa. Extortionist. Okay, let's accept and see what we got here. Find the valuable cargo. Um, there was a firefight an hour ago in the garages across the river. Just for my, okay, so this is in the um, circle check. Well, that makes it easier, Frosty. I was like, ah, oh, I got one, but it was on the scav run. Ah, I didn't realize that scav run would be found in raid. That's nice. Um, Let's see here. The door that can be wherever I see. 
somewhere. This one told me to get himself, and I'm sure he's got himself to find the key. Oh, no. Find the key, and then find the package. Okay. Nice. Okay. Name my docs his got money. <laughs> All right. How about doubles my money? Um, br 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 br. okay, so let's check our tasks out now. Character tasks. Okay, so customs, find the valuable cargo in the garages across the river. If you found, if you ensure found in raid items, it removes the tag. Ah, that makes sense. Hold on, keep my dog case open? Okay, hold on. I'll be right there. Hold on. Characters. Dog's case. One of these customs keys? The Yoda key I don't need. Okay. Okay, so what do I do with this customs key? Should I put it in my... The, the RB key. Right, this one. Vendor flea eventually, right. Portable cabin key and customs. There's a lot of, a lot of customs keys. Take the diary out and sell it to the peacekeeper. Okay. Got that. Diary, peacekeeper, money into the docks case. Pretty good amount of uh, dollars there. Okay, so it's this key. This key is cabin key for the factory. Cabin key. Trailer park. This is the machinery key to get my um, pocket watch. So I probably don't need this one anymore, right? Cool.
not sure which office building this is. Hmm. The Yoyota. Let's see if we can sell that. Can't sell it to your sell it to proper though. Yes, you will oh. join us one way or another. Okay. <laughs> All right, so uh, I'm not sure which key it is I need for this quest, so why don't we do a quick look up. Do, 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 the extortionist, Tarkov. Okay, I need... Unknown key. Okay. So the body is easy enough to find. It's right across the river. The cabin. Let's open with the unknown key is there. And the documents are under the jacket. But where do you get the unknown key? On the hidden body. Okay. So I have to get to the hidden body to get the key and then take the key through, around, to the cabin just outside of the old gas station. Okay, so I get the cow I get the key from the body. That's easy enough to get to. I rolled old gas, go under the bridge, and then the cabin should be right in front of me. Easy enough. That makes sense. Are we gonna try this? I think I'm gonna try this. All right, so we're set. We're ready to roll there. We've got that there. Why don't we pull one of these out? Because we'll have room for the key. Why don't we put the 90% one in instead? Then we're ready to roll with the key. We got that. We go get the body in the bush. Behind the thing next to the truck. We go to the cabin. Okay. So this is assuming we get a good spawn, of course. All right, so we're gonna start a prediction. Will Zach Walker survive the raid? Prediction started, escape from Tarkov, PMC. Next, customs, customs at Seven in the morning. Next, next. Sure, all ensure. Next and ready. Here we go. We're going into Tarkov. This will be our last raid of the stream because we're running out of time. I'm hoping for a decent spawn. I would take a crossroads spawn. It wouldn't be the greatest. I guess I could reverse engineer if I pop into warehouse 4. I could reverse engineer backwards through gas, but that's a lot of movement. 
So maybe we spawn at Smugglers. That would be our best option. Come through the corner shop area, pop back through the wall, follow the gates. Underneath and up. I mean, we got down there easy enough on our scav run, so it shouldn't be all that hard to pop in on a real run. Let's make sure our maps are up. Our map is up. We know where we're going. <laughs> no, that's easy channel points. Voting no is easy channel points. I would vote yes, but I can't. <clears throat> it's an easy win for you. Alright, we're gonna go. We can do this. Hey, Bloodshed. You're coming into my last raid. I have a very specific mission. I'm probably going to get shot in the head. That's how these things end. But we're going to do our best. By the way, thanks for following. Okay. Last raid of the day. We can do this. Or at least of the last raid of the stream. I spent a bit of time scabbing uh, at the end of last night to get enough weapons for a nice little two-hour stream. Worked pretty well. I feel like we're about to go in. Like, it's going to do the thing where it's like, oh, you're waiting, and then it's just going to be like, you're in, while I'm, like, not paying attention. I feel like the 10 minute timer is right about the um, right about the sweet spot if I pop it just when I leave raid. Here we go. Boom. Okay, just a reminder, um, I am wearing my Extra Life shirt. If you don't know what Extra Life is, uh, go ahead and Extra Life in the chat. Check it out. Uh, even if you don't donate through me. Check it out and do it if you don't do it, because it helps out. This is a great spawn for what I'm doing. Um, it helps out lots of people. Uh, lots, lots of kids who need uh, medical attention, so that's what Extra Life is, and I love to support it, so... What? Why? Full auto. Ready to roll. Okay, I'm pretty sure... Wanted to. This is exactly where we need to be. Just want to avoid the fog, really. Okay, so. We can do this. We 
near the welcome to Tarkov truck, we have to come to the back end here, and there's a bush. Don't really, I want to check that, but I don't want to die. There's a dead body. So now what we need to do is get... Oh shit, somebody's in there. Regen our stam and get the heck out of here. Go down into old gas under the bridge. Oh shiz. Yes, welcome back, Rusty. Uh, running time. Yep, I'm working on that. A bleed first, probably. Um, Alright, so let's get the bleed out. There we go, got rid of the bleed. We're going to be alright. Alright, there we go. Let's get this all done. I see. I fact flight leads, gotcha. Okay. Better priority on healing. Oh my god. <laughs> Did you see that? This guy's just ran right over me.
Ja. Okay, this bug that says I'm standing up right now, really trolling me out. Yeah. Do I make a break for it? I think I do. up and then straight ahead there's a little I'm looking for the little um, shack for the the quest that I just got I got the key already from the dead body there's a little locked shack out here that I need to jump into I think it's this one Stop the bleed. Broken arm. Okay. Cheese to the body. They go. Shits. All right, now we got to get out of here. Switching single file back to old gas and we're out of here. Heck yeah, we're done. We're just gonna jump the heck back out of here and try and get old gas extract. Okay. That's true. ZB11, ZB11, we are here, we need to run down the tracks to get to ZB11. Right.
DB12. We went DB12. Thank you, Wolfie. <laughs> oh my gosh. I think we just tasked. <laughs> Level 10. <laughs> Thank you, Frosty. <laughs> oh, Wolfie, this is insane. Next! <laughs> Amazing. Whew. Absolutely. Gives me a docs case, right? As soon as it allows me to click next. Oh. I want to say thank you, uh, Tarkov Wiki, and thank you, Wolfie. <laughs> uh, that was a surprise, to be fair. There we go. Ooh, look at that 11 to heal. We'll just go next. And then we'll do a, a heal for experience outside. That was intense. That's probably, I think that's only this, well, not including scav raids, because I've survived scav raids today, but that's the first PMC raid I got out of. Whew. All right, so let's go ahead and work on the heals a little bit. There's nothing too crazy, so we'll just pop a cheese. Get some experience. Uh, we got a wrench. Put that down here. In our toolbox. Then we are set there. Didn't really pick up much of anything else. Uh, we got that key. Then we're going to go turn in the task. With the... Who is that? Is that Skier? Handed over to Skier. Okay. So, dealers, Skier. Tasks, turn in. Cool. Don't use that pilgrim ever. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> right? Now that I'm level 10, I can start selling stuff. Don't use that pilgrim ever. That's, um, yeah, no, I'm not at my level. <laughs> I saw how big it was. I was like, ooh, yeah. All right, so that gives me another raid weapon and some money. <laughs> you don't want to be a blueberry. Yeah, I don't think I do. Not at my level. Um, <laughs> I just put stuff in it that um, I am only using in raids with multiple people. So, um, like that one. So, that's good. Okay, it's useless now? Okay. Okay, so we will um, drop that. You say I only need one customs key, right? So I can drop that. Cool. All right, so let's roll this a little bit this way. Okay, and then... We'll put that here. 
keys that are trash on the flea sell to therapist. Okay. So let's uh, check the flea market. I have yet to even see the flea market. So why don't we... Okay, so here's the flea market. And we will check keys. And then, um, minimum average estimate 23, maximum 152. Oh, there's an easy way to sell stuff. Go to inventory. Okay, hold on. Dealers, character, okay. Go to your inventory. Right click on the key. Filter by item. Okay. Why would anybody buy this key? Like, essentially, it's just something you could pick up every single raid, right? <laughs> Anything under 12k, sell the trader. Well, it's definitely under 12k. Because there's two up for it. Nobody's bought it. So I will sell that to a trailer. So therapist, sell the key. 962 for the therapist. Right. Stop. There we go. And then uh, let's do this one and see. Oh yeah, and it looks like everybody can get these keys fairly easily. And for almost the same amount of money. So. Cool. Alright. So now we've got everything here. And where did we get this? This is we just did we loot this? All right, that goes in the ammo. Go sell the labs key card, right? Filter. Oh my god, really? Uh, yeah. Put it up for two eighteen nine ninety nine. It's just also quick, right? Mm -hmm. uh what is this so uh don't click on the key hit the first plus sign there i go two eighteen ninety nine add and place offer Wait, wait, no, what's wrong? Oh, I see, I see. Two hundred and eighteen nine ninety nine. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. 
218.999. Perfect. Now I'll play software. There we go. <laughs> Put up for 21k when I get on. Nice ox car. All right. Well, I have to. See, did they already sell? Are you serious? YouTube. You will subscribe to Zex channel. It's free. Wow. It actually did sell super fast. <laughs> Oh, wow. Okay. Wow. Um, Jeebs. Anyway. <laughs> that is a wrap for our day. My gosh. Thank you guys so much. Frosty, thank you for uh, help, uh, helping to Sherpa me through. Oxcar, thank you for giving me encouragement and being around. Um, thanks for watching. I know you have a lot of choices. Thanks for spending your time with me. I really do appreciate it. Um, we are going to raid on off. Oh, yeah. You'll help me organize stuff? Sweet. Thank you. <laughs> uh, I do work tonight, though, so it's going to be a bit rougher on that. Uh, let's see who we're going to raid on off to. We've got lots of friends live. Let's see who is the. We got Exist on Rocket League. Uh, Mr. Tons is doing Tarkov. Murder Stew is a guy who killed me for a shooter born in heaven. Okay, so it looks like um, we have a little guy, Mr. Tons. He's bigger than us, but. Not by much. So why don't we raid on over? He's playing Tarkov, and we'll give him some love. So. Bye-bye, everybody. See you later.